comes. Boom! Just like that, but you guys are tuned in to Teenagers on a Mission, Konalago, SABC1 Mzanti for sure. Japanese Monella, the freshest presenters, are in the building, about to take you guys on a journey for the next 30 minutes into the world of science and technology. Mm-hmm, guys, but TMZ is all about that. We keep you occupied and entertained. Forty yep. Nkowe and Mzanti is going to thrill your senses. Most definitely. So, in this episode, Kuluma and Mzanti is a very simple household thing. And I'm going to sit in the in my car. It's Kuluma and printmaking. You guys printmaking? Of course I do. Printmaking has been around for so long, guys. And in the case of my so look about Skuzi, how did it append the art of the world? Aha, uh -huh, 40k. So one about how a printmaking can make it possible for Abantu to make prints from the same art piece. Yeah. And how it has made it accessible to more people. That's a game changer already. Can you hear it? Just because of that, we're going to be talking about it on today's episode. Sbone, the revolutionary nature of printmaking. Mm -hmm. Why are we still here? Let's get into it. Bagashela is a studio that takes printmaking in Mzansi to the next level. Slangana with students who get to benefit from this awesome art form and see the amazing techniques they use to create magic. Travel back in time to see where printmaking techniques started out. Of course, we know technology is going to take it even further and test your know-how in our epic quiz. Sambin! Well, we're facing as good as a from Nina. Sambin is a good social media. What do you guys know about printmaking? We've got us tweets coming in from Michelle underscore M. Otiena. Printmaking, Yayenza Eskela, and I love it with all my heart. Definitely, I also love it. We also got a tweet coming in from Utato Otiena. What is printmaking? What's that? You're watching the right show because I'm trying to say, I'm going to say, printmaking, gotcha, gotcha. If you guys have four questions you want to ask us, all you got to do is catch us on our social media pages on Facebook, CTOMZ, on Twitter, we are Tom's underscore SABC underscore. Well, you have to go to the town to come. So, I'm going to go to We started a game of fits with our road shots. This is so it's an umpire of one secondary school. We're talking about printmaking. Right next to me is a gentleman. It's a cool man. I fit out him. Yes, you. What's your name? Rofio. Rofio, what grade are you doing? 11. Is grade 11 fun? You blind, you. You have no idea. You have no idea. You have no idea. Oh, like, you know, kind of learn new things. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. Okay, my point for you, you need printmaking. Why need printmaking, I should say? Printmaking, I yeah. think, like, maybe, Kuluma, like, yeah, print, yeah, but, like, maybe t shirt printing. Yeah. You know, something like your cap. So, yeah, yeah. yeah some print, you know. Yeah. Oh, print, yeah. yeah. If I can't skip any, but you print it. Yeah. You know, when you keep it. What are you doing? What are you doing? Grade 11. Okay, so I want to know now, what is printmaking? What about printmaking? What should you Printmaking is when, like, so you are painting the flyers and giving it to people or painting the clothes. Mm. Yeah, writing the labels. Printmaking, like you said, when you're in Zinja, for a t-shirt, a pair? No. I have a piece of paper, a jacket, a jacket, a jacket, a jacket, a jacket, a jacket, a jacket. Okay. So, what do you think about when you enjoy it? Uh... Mang draw ya. After then, me nya paint and nya inza and ma color different. I you paint, paint, painting. Yeah. Why? Why you paint? Ha. Okay, lang ma color one. Yeah. We design moto, we draw it. Yeah. All right. Before we get into the cool details, if you guys want to get on the Sicilian land of apron making, let's watch. Printmaking is a form of art in which an image or design is transferred through contact with what they call a matrix. A matrix can be anything from a block or plate to a stone or screen. Now this process produces many versions of the same piece of art known as a print. When many are printed from the same plate, it's known as an addition. Printmaking often involves special tools like sharp instruments or rollers. Woodcut is the earliest printmaking technique and was first developed to print patterns on cloth in the Far East. By the 5th century, printers in China were using woodcut techniques to print text and images on paper. In the 1430s, engraving was developed by goldsmiths in Germany to decorate metalwork. And a few decades later, etching came onto the same scene and was used to decorate Amor in a much easier way than engraving. Art gear comes in different shapes and sizes. Yeah. Forty, the first monotype printer was made, Emelika, and it was over 137 meters long. Wow. So what had happened is a bunch from the community actually came together, mm -hmm. and then they painted this large sheet, which was off the steam world as a print. Mm -hmm. Can I tell you what you guys think with social media here too? And Forty, how you can get your community involved to be art projects? Yeah. Sabuya, guys. Don't go anywhere. Mm -hmm. Hey, 
Ha. Sibu yile ke wanda wata you are tuned into TOMZ. Apa ke sibu siwa nzansi for sure. Mwezi abe kile vafeti tiskati entertainment and inyaz gutu kushukti in logo ngish. Education and entertainment at the same time. How about that? Mhm. And Sanjuke is all about art and it's many unique forms, including. Printmaking. Printmaking. Uh, printmaking is taking the art world by storm. Yeah. Pamela, it's a stunner. Ooh, check this out, man. Hey yo, it's your boy C-A-W-D-Y, pronounced Caddy. Yet on another mission, running the streets of Johannesburg. Touchdown in Newtown, but first. Today's mission is all about printmaking. What exactly is printmaking and what it means to her and how it changes the world around her. Is you me in this mission? Let's get it. Hello. How are you? Good and you? Good. What's up, Anna? Ah, nice. Fresh 100. So, I'm going to mission you, Amne. Yes. Okay, before we do anything, can you share a little bit about it? We're going to go to the group. Okay. We're going to go to Rene, Matibe, or Rene. And we're going to go to the new town at the Bass Factory. Yeah. Artist Proof Studio. Okay, so what's going on at the Bass Factory? Okay, so Artist Proof Studio is a teacher printmaking skills. Okay. And I am teaching. I'm a teacher. Okay. And I teach drawing and visual literacy. Okay, cool. So arts, visual literacy, drawing, printmaking, what is all of that? Okay, so printmaking, it's only art, so it's part of art. Okay. Um, it's an old technique yeah. um, of handmade, hand printing. Okay. So today, we have the digital printing, the photography and all that thing. Yeah. And, but we do like the ancient way of printing. Sogula. Yes. Wow. This is the place. Uh huh. This is the studio. So where we at right now is the drawing space. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. So Renee, before we do anything, there, what inspired you to be in an environment like this? So I've always been interested in art. Yeah. And I studied Go UJ. Okay. I did my degree there in I finished Ka 2012. Sure. And then Ka started Ka 2012. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So Yin, let's keep on. What's happening here? I can see like there's a lot of people drawing. There's a lot of pens, rulers. Cardboard, scissors, paint. A lot of things. Yeah. So we have a three-year program, educa education program, okay. um, where we take our students through different techniques okay. and also different ways of drawing. So the very kisa material thing are like painting, um, drawing in terms of ink drawings and charcoal drawing, pencil okay. drawings. Okay. So first year, well, for all the years actually, the start of drawing pili okay. before you can print. So since so I draw a pili and then wa. Get your drawing to a level of a good drawing. Cool. And when I leave them sitting at the table back and get on, so we give students uh, briefs, okay. and then they have to interpret the brief. Got the drawings up on the idea, what they're gonna use, where, yeah. how. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Cool. So, cool. Me, I'm a technique. Ne, I'm from a technique. So, what's the inside? Go printmaking. Okay. So. Maybe I'll just touch on, on one that they do that, that's very easy. Okay. The uh, lino cut. Okay. And then the material is this thing here. Uh -huh. It's one of the tapete. Like oh. tapete, it's very easy to do. Yeah. And then what, what, ha what usually happens is you carve. So you carve out your, your image. Okay. So you use... Um, Lino tools okay. um, to carve out your, your image. Whatever you carve out, yeah. it's about white. Okay. And then the, the ink will go on top and then it'll be black and white. Oh, wow. Depends if what, what ink you're using, which color or whatever. Yeah. Okay. okay, cool. Relief printing is one of the more common types of printmaking. Now, this involves a process where a protruding face of a block or a plate are inked and the recesses are ink free. When this face is applied to a surface, the pieces that were sticking out make a mark while those that weren't are left empty. Now this is a very useful type of printing to make patterns that stand out in artworks that have a stark contrast between black and white. Many geometric prints are done in this way. Okay, go. Let's go to my environment to get in the space seller. Yeah. So where we are right now, get drawing space. Okay. So as I mentioned before, Jorge gave a teacher drawing. So this is where we would start. We would start with a 
are still live and the students would draw and then after that we go to the other side which is the printing side. That's where all the printing happens and I will introduce you to students um, who are going to take you through one or two techniques. Okay, cool. Okay. That's yeah. awesome. Sure. We're going to meet them now. Yes. Okay, that's one game. <laughs> so, Caddy, yes. this is the printing space okay. and this is Precious. She Hello, is Hi. <laughs> so great to meet you. She is currently doing her third year and they're going to have a show um, this Saturday. Saturday. Yeah. So she's going to show you the line of cut um, technique that I was telling you earlier. Okay. And she'll take you through the process. Okay, cool. See you again. We'll see you later. All right. Cool. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. Hi, guys. Hello, Fresh. Okay, so now I'm going to I'm going to do a line of technique. Okay. We call it a line of cut. So, we use the use of the bait. So, we use the bait. Okay. So, what we do is uh, we draw on it. Yeah. So, it's in the same way. So basically we use a pencil. Sure. So we just draw on it whatever that you want to draw. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then what happens is you use your scooping tools. So Sinama scooping tools. Okay. So with the scooping tools, but you have to be careful. Melio Ubege Santa Sakola. And then you carve it out. Okay. So it's because magu you enter itinig and then you can yeah it's very hard so you do anything that you wanna do any image that you wanna yeah okay do and then so what happens is mastreta because now I'm just touching up on this okay and then mastreta we're gonna take it to the printing table yeah so lagune inky corner and then we just put it on ink we're rolling it up. One type of ink is called a polar ink, which means the molecules inside it have a high attraction to water molecules. When you use this ink on paper, something amazing happens. The paper is made up of cellulose fibers, which have OH molecules sticking out of them. So when the ink comes into contact with the paper, the H molecules in the ink bind with the H molecules in the paper, creating a thin layer of water. The rest of the ink then forms molecular bonds within this layer, making it stick to the paper. Mm. No, what happens is ink lang cave corner. It's a one-way thing. Okay. Once I carved out, it's gonna be white because we're using it black ink. Okay. So what happens is nzo cover out lana. Yeah. so it's gonna be white on the paper okay. and on the image. I can't reverse. I can't erase. grab We put it inside the printing. A uh, press, okay. so it's called an etching press. Okay. 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 See, Farah Lapayana after putting it with the paper on top, but do zobo And then what happens is, guzoba mshope and then black, and then we can also use different colors, but it's also another technique on its own. Yeah. We call it a lino reduction. That's where you'll be able to add like different colors. Yeah. So ganja lo ganja Okay. So minang funu guys get pressure from you, ne? Because why did you choose to do e printmaking? Uh, basically, uh, we art industry ne? Yeah. is like uh, being a tandy, the fact you go to mailing in the like the painting in one and then that's it. Uh -huh. So I thought of the people and also because e printing, if, I mean, printmaking, it's basically about reproduction. Mm -hmm. I can make one, but 10 or 100 of it, mm -hmm. and then everyone is like satisfied. Yeah, young okay. So yeah. That's why I made it. And any time. Okay, cool. You're born a very good time. Do you have I know. Did you cut that? Yeah. Zogali is about shallop as Yamanga Lee's. Wow. You guys are definitely doing a good job. Keep it up. Mm-hmm. I hope you're going to in notes. There are some brilliant techniques that you guys could use there. Let's play a little guys, what you guys think of social media. So I'm going to write about now. Charms. Charms. 
And we're back just like that, but first, you guys still tuned in to TOMZ Konalago SABC 1 Mzansi for sure. And we're on our last stretch in today's episode. I hope you guys are enjoying it. Mm-hmm. For the city, Ndiko, your younger ladies, and Kuboi Bona Avanam Slanji, Siteta and printmaking, and just how this big idea is changing the art world forever. Okay, I want to printmaking by Sha like life. Yay! Well, but first, we're about to show you. Check this out. Okay, so I'm going to tell you printmaking, you can use it to make your own art. And why are you guys like teaching this specific art? Okay, so printmaking is different. Take for instance a painting. Sure. It's a one-off. You paint on one board yeah. or a canvas, mm -hmm. and then that's, you, you just sell it, and then that's it. Yeah. Got printmaking, you can addition your works. Okay. So if you make a plate and you, you carve or you etch or you, you know, different mm. techniques, mm. you can have maybe 30, 40 prints of the same thing. So yeah. it's easier to sell a lot. Yeah. And you can you can sustain yourself okay. through the art. Okay, speaking yeah. of sustaining yourself, mm -hmm. how far can you go with printmaking? You can go like, yes, because there's a lot of techniques. Yeah. So you can go anywhere, actually, because printmaking is recognized as an art form okay. in the whole world, so yeah. Okay. I had a great time. Thank you so much for inviting us. Yes. It's been absolutely amazing. Mm -hmm. And I've learned so much about the printmaking. And thank you guys for coming. It's been an amazing day. Hey. Yes, most definitely all the best for the future. Cool. Hey man, what an awesome day. I am so inspired by Fetin. Thank you, Fundile and I'm Tanja Izuguti. It's science is in the art of printmaking. And as Boni Lugut, printmaking is moving to the next level of Fetu to change your life and the people around you. This is what we call mission accomplished with your boy CA DDY pronounced Katie. I'm out. Cool, in here's my favorite to get to the Sandwich Zula. And what is a trip without coming to your school to play a TOMZ? Well, I'm trying to get a printmaking and it's full of can I go to well. The blue team and the green team, no, I think I think what is printmaking. Now, La Pamaka, you can also join us on our social media pages. Konamanji, as well, I go to which team took it home? Check this out. Touchdown of one in secondary school. We're going to have two teams that are going to battle each other. If not, Lapin Makai, you want to join us, all you got to do is catch us on our social media pages. On Facebook, we are at TOMZ. On Twitter, it's Tom's underscore SFPC underscore one. game, right? So the blue team and the green team get to choose their three champions. Abazova represents La. So, blue team, green team, please choose your three champions. <laughs> Okay, cool. So the blue team and the green team have selected their three champions. Katsuguti Samba, Siuba Mita. So Kala Ngapagu, Ikurv, Eshlaza. Someone is Suam. Hi. Are you guys ready? Yes. Okay, guys, I want to know how much I'm going to win. No, I'm going to win. Okay, um, I'm going to win. I'm going to win. I'm going to win. I'm going to win. Because I'm going to win. I'm going to win. I'm going to win. I'm going to win. So, yeah. Okay, okay, okay. I'm going to win. 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 I'm going my name is Dana Nomaleleka. My, my team also chose me because they trust me and yeah, they know that yeah, I've got that power, I know. Okay. <laughs> Give it up for the green team. <laughs> okay, blue team. Nick Grant. Yes. You guys going to win? Yep. Yes. Okay. So guys, I'm going to go to the next one. I'm going to go to the next one. They chose me because they believe in me and that I won't disappoint. Uh, my name is Mukwebo Ones. Uh, they chose me because they faith in me and uh, I'm going to make them move. Okay. Uh, my name is Nicholas Nico. Uh, they chose me because they know that I'm famous. Yeah, and also to say that I can't disappoint these guys. Okay, okay. Give it up for the blue team. <laughs> Okay, okay, so guys, these are the rules, ne? I'm going to ask you guys three questions, ne? But the fastest team to press the buzzer gets to answer the question. If you get the question right, 10 points. If you press the buzzer and then you ask the answer to the question, you can ask your team, ne? But that's five points. You got the rules? Okay, cool. It's time to play the TOMZ quiz. Can we please have our first question? What do most types of printmaking involve, ne? Transferring ink from a matrix to another material. B, making an extra copy of an artwork. C, printing with a digital printer. D, etching new works of art. Which one is it? Press the buzzer if you know the answer. Press the is Yes. Okay, printing it in the answer you need. I think it's D. Oh, D. Let's see if your answer is right. Is it? 
Is it? Deontay is a... Hare. Askisini. Moving on to our second question. The question here to you is to which element inside ink causes it to have color? Is it A, resin? Is it B, sugar? Is it C, pigment? Or is it D, paint? Which one is it? Okay, the blue team was first. Got it, D. 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 Is it? Is it? And the answer is C. Dollar links. <laughs> okay, so the score, score points you can change up here. So the green team is on zero points, and the blue team is on zero points. Guys, this is the last question. Ne? Whichever team gets it right, they win. Okay. Our last question is: Which part of the eye makes it possible to see in color? Is it A, the retina? Is it B, the iris? Is it C, the lens? Or D, the photo sensors? Which one is it? How oh, blue team is fast. Guys, you need to think about this one. Which one is it? C. C. Are you guys sure? Yes. You, you don't want to ask your team? You sure, sure, sure? Yes. Okay, but the answer is C. Let's see if the answer is really C. D. Ah, guys. Ah, that's the end of the TOMZ Quest Buffet 2. We have no winner for today. The green team is on zero and the blue team is on zero. If none from Jan Nate Makar, you gotta do is catch us on our social media pages. Go Facebook, see Tom's on Twitter, it's Tom's underscore SAPC underscore one. Until next time, adios. Also a printmaking, sit down and don't gany gany. Footy, if you try to eat it, let's see. I'm a techniques that Dala are spreading to developing countries that did not have them before. Now, Lokuga enables these nations to make a living off printing in their small businesses. Ama artists are making the public more aware of this art form by peering prints out on everyday commercial objects. 3D printing is taking it to the next level, making more lifelike prints possible. And limited editions are becoming a thing of the past as social media brings art to everyone. What is the Wow, now I do have to try for myself, configure Kaya. Now I can. Most definitely. Mm-hmm. Nani Babugeli, please do share your projects or thoughts. Go TOMZ at sabc.co.za. And if you want us to visit your school, do the set. Uh-huh. Don't forget, Buffet, because we are live on social media. On Facebook, we are TOMZ. On Twitter, it's Tom's underscore SAPC underscore one. Don't forget to visit our website, go www.tomz.co.za. Until next time, Buffet, students is on board at the same time, same place. You know how it is. TOMZ, sign out. Here's what's coming up next time on TOMZ. Lake Company can know how to do the best with the least. Save our precious resource in the process. What is water anyway? Have you ever wondered where the water on our earth comes from? Have you ever wondered why Omanzi are so happy? Find out what our water future looks like. Well, for sure, we book at the TOMZ every Thursdays and Fridays from half past two. Tambama, Kuala Lumpur, SABC One. We're live and TV. Oh, one.